Hey there, everybody. So when you go to set up your business email account in Outlook, are you getting this dreaded Outlook error? Something went wrong. We couldn't create the Outlook data file. Make sure the disk you're saving to isn't full or write protected and that the file isn't being used. So this is a pretty common error that uh, I've noticing that you know when I do the research this comes up a lot and the whole make sure the disk you're saving to isn't full or write protected and that the file isn't being used is not helpful at all. Um, reason being uh, in my case, I have plenty of space. This is a two gig hard drive. I'm sorry, a two terabyte hard drive, and I'm not even using a terabyte of space. So that's definitely not the issue. Uh, I definitely know that things aren't right protected. So that's not an issue either. So when you get this error, you need to start your Outlook in safe mode. And here's how you do that. So we're going to close Outlook down completely. And then you go over here to your Windows Start menu. Actually, you don't even need to go down there to your Windows Start menu. All you need to do is on your keyboard, you, you see this um, icon here? You're looking for that icon on your keyboard. That's the Windows icon. You're going to hit Windows and R. Okay, that's for that brings up the Run menu. Now what you're going to do is you're going to type in Outlook. If I can type properly, .exe space forward slash safe. This is going to start Outlook in safe mode. And choose a profile. Do I have other profiles? No. We're just going to do OK. And now that's starting Outlook in safe mode. I'm going to minimize all this. I don't need to see any of that. So once Outlook's set up in safe mode, we can go to File, Add Account. And in here, we're going to type the account name that we're trying to add. So if you have uh, an email account that you've got uh, purchased through uh, Namecheap um, or you know GoDaddy or whatever else, wherever your, your domain is registered and you're, you're going and you're actually purchasing a professional um, custom email account through one of those domain registers, this is where you would type your actual email address in. So I'm going to do that. And then once you've got your address in, you're not going to do anything else. Now, on Namecheap, uh, it will, if you go to Namecheap and you go to their support section to figure out how to set up your Outlook, some of the videos are outdated and they're going to have you click on advanced options and do a manual setup and you're going to fail. It's not going to, it's not, you're not going to have any success. The, um, the advanced options aren't even necessary. All you need to do here is just click on connect. And then all you're going to do is click on your password and enter your password and click on connect. And all it took was starting out looking safe mode. So that's it. You're all set up with your business email that you've got uh, that you purchased through Namecheap. Thanks for watching.